Hello and welcome to the EOP Blackboard course at Fresno State. This is the first of two tutorials. The tutorials will provide you a course overview of EOP Blackboard. To log in, make sure you are on Blackboard. Log in by using your username and password. Once you log in, the Courses and Organizations page will appear. Under your course list menu, click on the EOP link. From there, it will take you to the EOP Blackboard homepage. EOP Blackboard was developed to provide you information about EOP requirements, critical dates, resources, and much more. On the left-hand side of the homepage, you will see the main menu with links. The body of the homepage includes my announcements, my task, and my calendar. Under my announcements, announcements will be posted by your EOP counselor and peer mentor throughout the semester. An important side note, please click on the settings button to the right of my announcements. Under edit my announcements view, select all, and then click on submit. This will allow you to view all announcements throughout the semester. Please follow the same steps for My Calendar. Click on the Settings button. Under Edit My Calendar View, select All, and then click on Submit. The semester calendar lists critical dates throughout this semester. Further down, My Tasks lists your EOP requirements for the semester. There are six requirements you must fulfill this semester. These requirements are not in any particular order. The first one, peer mentor meeting number one. Attend an academic advising session. Counselor meeting. Peer mentor meeting number two. Workshop requirement number one in person. Workshop requirement number two online. For workshop requirement number one, we highly encourage you to attend a workshop in person. The monthly workshops calendar will be emailed to you at the beginning of each month. You can also access the workshops calendar on the main menu under Course Documents. For workshop requirement number two, you can complete an online workshop. The online workshops are located on the main menu under Online Student Development Workshops. Once you have completed a requirement, please check it off. It is your responsibility to check off any completed requirements. To check off a requirement, click on the requirement, click on OK, select the requirement, scroll down to Status, and select Set Completed. To the right, under Task Status, it will indicate that the task has been completed. Continue to do this with the rest of the requirements once you have completed them. You are now finished watching tutorial number one. Tutorial number two will give you a review of the items on the main menu. Thank you for your time and good luck.